currently here in Fort Pierce, Florida. And now I'm actually I'm headed out. I'm headed out right now. Supposed to be going home next weekend. Been missing my family like crazy. Though. I don't know, I ain't gonna lie to you. I've been missing the chaos that goes on in the house. You know what I mean? So other than that, everything else been pretty good. I got a moment of uh, meditation, you know what I'm saying, out here on Fort Pierce. Fort Pierce? Fort Pierce is a cool place, man. Um, cool little beach area, very chill, very laid back, you know what I'm saying? Like where the area I was at was pretty cool, you know what I mean? Um, but when I first got here, I was in Pompano, which at first I was saying, I was pronouncing it as Papano, but it's actually Pompano, Pompano Beach. And it was, it was cool too, but there's a lot of homelessness down there, man. You know what I'm saying? I didn't feel too, you know what I'm saying, cool like being, you know what I'm saying, like a, I guess you said a tourist in that, in that case, you know what I'm saying, the area and just to hang around up and like that. So, uh, other than that, uh, my loads, man, like all the shippers down here has been taking forever, man, to unload. I don't know why, you know what I'm saying? I guess it's just something dealing with Florida being like a main, you know what I'm saying? distribution type area or whatnot, but it's just been crazy down here, man. Really happy messing up my money, too. But, we still moving forward, you know what I'm saying? So, right now, I'm coming off a of fresh 70 right now. So, if I can go ahead and take advantage of this thing, get it rocking, get it rolling, you know what I'm saying? Keep my mind first, you know what I'm saying? I'm on the creative, pray, and go ahead and get to the bread, man. You know what I'm saying? My little girl, but she been she been up, up top, man. She been, she been going off. You know what I'm saying? I'm proud of her, man. Proud of my wife as well. Uh, hopefully my wife will be here with me next week. Though. That's 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 what we're looking forward to. So, there's a couple things I got to get squared away um, before even coming out next week or out the home time next week. Um, but so far, man, what I've been kind of feeling is. Patience out here, man. You gotta have patience, man, because um, I don't want to be in a rush for anything because I'm noticing when you're in a rush for something, man, you put yourself in binds. Like, you know what I'm saying? You really put yourself in binds. And um, you got to be very responsible with your time so you can plan everything right. That's not even dealing with just um, just driving or, or being a, a driver or anything. It's just, just in general. Like, even... Um, well, I just personally feel like, man, in my last interview with they, um, with their local account, they really messed my time up. They kind of, they kind of BS me. That's how I really feel. You know what I'm saying? Um, then I had already kind of got the feel that they didn't really care about the driver. You know what I'm saying? So I, I had already felt that, but I had slightly ignored it and went in anyway and messed up my time. So. I'm trying to be very sensitive to patience and also being able to listen to my heart on certain things. You know what I mean? And um, make the most of my time is basically with, um, after meditating yesterday. That's what I really came up with. Make the most of my time now. You know what I'm saying? Well, it's the age that I am now. Like, you got to make the most of your time. You can't be out here playing around, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, straight up. You know? It's tough because you by yourself so much. And I'm to be honest with you, bro. I am I am a loner. I'm a guy who stayed to myself. But it's like at the same time, you got a family. You know what I'm saying? It's like it really forces me to think now. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna go ahead and hit the road, bro. Hope y'all like on uh, the content I'm giving you guys. Some uh, some content, man, is just gonna be like me just talking. I haven't even really developed a format. You know what I'm saying to give you guys. So it's like whatever I feel that day, I, I just do it. I feel like doing like a little cool vlog, I do it. You know what I'm saying? But I really want to build a, um, I want to build friends on here. So that's that's been my thing. So really, to go back to, I guess you say, the purpose of this video, I learned how to be patient, listen to my inner self, you know what I'm saying? And how to stay focused out here, you know what I mean? And not to get so emotional, emotionally break down, you know what I'm saying? But really how to focus, focus, focus. And make it worth your time, I guess, and take advantage of it. So, I mean, I hope you guys are chilling. Hope y'all are cooling. If you ever want to visit, uh, I guess you say this side of Florida, man, 
go to well Fort Pierce go to this thing called the jetty it's very small it's very few bars there but it's real cool and very relaxed it's not like a mainstream area like a Miami or South Beach or like that it's just a very cool place to chill think to yourself meditate you know what I'm saying it's not it's not much there but it's enough you know what I'm saying especially if you go in the hours of um Especially if you go in the hours of where it's not a lot of traffic. And especially if you're trucking, you really can kind of go in. You're doing like a 34 or something. You can go down there at any given hour. So, uh, guys, look into that. Uh, look it up on Google. Or whatnot. It's pretty cool, though. So, I'm out, man. Let me go ahead and hit this road. Y'all stay blessed, man. You know what I'm saying? Keep the man above up first. Stay prayed up while you're on the road. And I'm going to take it in. Stay blessed. Thank you.